Hey Captains, this is Karendar. In this quick video, I will highlight the main details of Update 0810, the Italian Cruisers Part 2, where we have the introduction of the full Italian cruiser line and the tech tree. We have a new treat beginning this update that gives us a chance to earn three additional port slots with each update. Beginning December 1st, for completing daily chains, the 3 chain, 9 chain, and 20 chain completion rewards will also include a port slot. This update, you should also see a combat mission in your port for the second anniversary of Steam. This is a two-part mission where you can earn five expendable Steam camouflage and a Steam container. <clears throat> there is also another reset multiplier available for the Research Bureau for any participating in that. We will also be having a new Tier 10 ranked battle season this update. But the biggest discussion in this update is how to maximize the containers and the tokens required to give you the best chance to complete the new Italian collection in this update and earn the unique commander Luigi Sansonetti. He has several unique skills. The first is Scorch by Fury, which activates when you score Confederate Achievement, and this reduces the reload time of your main battery guns by 15%. The next is Triumphant Hall, which activates after you destroy an enemy ship and extends the main battery firing range by 8%. This can be activated once per battle. Desperate Resistance activates after you score 100 main battery shell hit ribbons, and this skill prolongs the action time of all consumables by 10%. This activates once per battle. He also has special boost to the captain skills, Expert Loader, which allows you to reduce switching shell type by 75% instead of 50, and Torpedo Acceleration, which increases the speed by 7 knots instead of the normal 5 knot increase. He's a very solid looking captain. Sansonetti can be earned by completing the 16-piece Italia Regia collection, which you unlock by opening your first Resolute and Rapid container. In each container is one piece of the collection. And these containers can be attained in several different ways. First, simply logging in daily. For each day that we log in up to 10 days, Wargaming gives us various goodies. We can gain three Resolute and Rapid containers in this way. In addition to this, we can also gain 30 of this update's new Mediterranean tokens. The next is by completing this month's Regia Marina directives. There are four parts to these directives, and the first is unlocked and live now. The other three stages unlock over the next couple of weeks. The dates are shown when you mouse over each of the directive stages. One container is rewarded for completing each of the stages 1 and 2, while with stages 3 and 4, we're rewarded two containers for each stage, so six containers in total for completing the directives. In addition to those containers we can earn, we can also earn Mediterranean tokens by completing the directive stages and their missions. For completing each of the four stages of the directives, we're rewarded 80 tokens for stage 1, and 100 each for the stages 2, 3, and 4, for a total possible of 380 tokens for completing the directive stages. There are also 10 missions in each of the four directives for a total of 40 missions that each reward 8 tokens for a total possible 320 additional tokens from these. As usual with directive events, once you're finished the directives, the Hall of Fame is unlocked and this update will be giving away consumable camouflage for various stages attained. Checking the rules button details how points are earned for the Hall of Fame. Another way to earn Resolute and Rapid containers is to unlock the Bella Italia Twitch mission by watching World of Warships streams on Twitch. This three-part mission allows you to earn four Regia Marina consumable camouflage, one aiming system mod one upgrade module, four battle hardened consumable camouflage, and most importantly two additional Resolute and Rapid containers. This would bring you to a total maximum possible of 11 containers you can be rewarded in this update. Also, in addition to the previous mentioned tokens, the daily chain missions for every XP chain completed earns one more token, so up to six more tokens are possible for each day for 27 days, with a total of up to an additional 162 tokens that can be earned in this way. So, in total, in this update, 892 tokens can be earned. And now you ask, what can I do with all these tokens, Karendar? Well, you go to the Armory, and then the new Italian Navy section where you can buy expendable camel, credits, premium time, signal flags, or probably the main target, the Resolute and Rapid containers. These cost 30 tokens each, so if you manage to collect every possible token, you'd be able to buy up to 29 more containers and add them to your potential of up to 11 previously earned containers, making a total maximum possible containers in this update of 40 without buying any premium containers. Wargaming has also stated that if for some reason you're unable to complete this collection in 0810, these containers will be coming to the armory in future for coal. 
I'll include a Wargaming video link in my comments below this video that walks you through just how to link your Warships and Twitch accounts. Also, if you have Amazon Prime, you also have Twitch Prime included with that for free, and this allows you to subscribe and support one favorite streamer each month free of charge to you. As with any collection, to minimize the number of containers required to complete your collection, you want to accumulate pieces and keep opening containers until you have enough duplicates to complete the entire collection before spending any of your duplicates. In this collection, you can exchange four duplicates to fill one piece of the collection. Besides attaining the unique commander, you can also gain four days of premium warships account for completing the four stages of this collection. This has been a lot of information in a short video, but I hope it helps you to complete your collection in this update and earn yourself the excellent Italian commander Luigi Sansonetti. That's all for now. Thank you very much for watching. Like, subscribe, and until next time, good hunting.